and I was being sent back to Hong Kong and we went to police station we went to police station and we gone through again some I don't know so-called administration work including me writing the thank you letter to police like thank you for letting me to to learn how the development how great is China how the development in China it's it's going I was being taken a lot of photos when I was in the mainland China so if I keep silent maybe one day these letters or these photos will become the evidence of my patriotism and I just want to tell the world that it's not true I was being forced to do so it was about um, things like um, I feel regret of my participation in the social movement in Hong Kong and um, now I would like to have I would like to change myself and I would like to learn more in Canada and um, and I would not be getting involved in this social in these kind of social movement anymore and I would not be contacting any of my friends in demo system and scholarism anymore that was really a unforgettable moment for me but I was still very scared because until the last moment you won't know you won't you 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 wouldn't know would you be really able to leave Hong Kong so I think the most kind of surreal moment for me is when the plane started to you know to, to fly My freedom, my daily life, my basic rights were all being deprived in the past three years. <laughs> Hong Kong is my home. And Hong Kong will be forever my home. But at the same time, experiencing the past three years, I feel like Hong Kong for me, it's also a place of fear. It's not only because of the suppression from the national security police, but because of the whole political atmosphere in Hong Kong after the implementation of the national security law, that everyone's trying to self-censor and no one including myself are willing is willing to voice out any kind of you know critic um, you know criticism to to the government because they would easily get arrested so it's it's a city full of fear